Hi, I'm Elizabeth Addis reporting for Cal TV Sports. I'm here with Christina Nigue with Cal Women's Basketball Team. Thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for having me. In your season opener against Houston, you played exceptionally well, scoring 37 points and defeating the Cougars 80 to 79. How are you feeling about this upcoming season? I'm really proud of my team. I think it was a team effort. I feel like we all bought into the game plan and we were all able to execute. At the end, it was a little um, tight, but we were able to pull through and get the win. You're such a strong leader of this team. How did you adopt this role over the past three years? And how do you feel you lead the team both on and off the court? I try to be very vocal and um, bring energy. Also lead by example, then we have Asia, she's been our leader for the past three years and looking up to her, a phenomenal point guard. Um, she brings a lot of experience as well and just trust. So she knows where to get the ball, who to get the ball to at critical moments in the game and just, just make the right plays. And I know as an athlete, you undergo so much stress. What mental tool do you use under pressure? Um, under pressure, I don't really feel pressured at any time. Like I just feel like I'm always playing my game. I'm always in control and I've had to learn how to do that by meditating or just like taking like me time before games. And finally, you were recently named to the 20 player watch list for the 2019 Lisa Leslie Award. How does it feel to be named one of the top centers in the nation? I'm very humbled to like be on that list because there are a lot of great players, especially in the pack on different lists, but on this list I'm the only Pac-12 player. And um, it kind of goes to show you that we have a lot of talent in the Pac-12. Well, thank you so much for your time. I'm Elizabeth Addis. And I'm Christina Nigue. Go Bears! Go Bears.